Leo, good morning and welcome to your general reading. My name's Clive, you're watching Emery's Tarot. It's my great pleasure to be here and read for everybody. The only message I've got for you before we start is please take the bits that resonate, leave the rest. Don't try and make it fit as this will lead you to wrong conclusions, okay? So without further ado, what's going on for you? Messages and energies for you, please. Wow, unexpected news coming in. I'm kind of getting this energy of thinking on your feet very, very quickly. There is a decision here to be made. I'm getting there's an opportunity coming your way where you do have to think fairly quickly. It's an opportunity that will pass you by if you try procrastinating. I'm getting here for some of you unwanted communication, perhaps from somebody who is narcissistic, controlling. They could even have an addiction. You're trying to help, you've been trying to help them in the past by supporting them. It would seem here that somebody is not listening to what you're saying. Communication is very to the point. You have been, for some of you, I've got something to say to this person. I'm trying to get in the put, putting your point of view across in the past has been very, very difficult. But this this news does change things rather radically. Like I say, some of you perhaps in a situation where you have to think very quickly. Okay. And on the work front on getting a job interview, okay which is rather surprising because it could be from a job that you applied for months ago, never got an answer, things have happened, things have changed, and now you're getting your answer, just when you least expect it. All right. mm. I'm kind of getting here as well that you feel like you're being rushed by someone, pressurised, you're trying to slow it down. I'm getting this energy here of, I need time to think. Oh, mm. <laughs> judgment. I'm not surprised that card came out. OK, you don't really want to hurt anybody. But what, what I'm getting here is somebody's coming back in on the rebound. Perhaps you were dating or seeing somebody and or even married to somebody and they explored another avenue, another opportunity. Kind of not so much dumped you, but you know, put you on the back burner, so to speak. And now that didn't work out and now they're coming back around. Mm. You're wondering what's going on, Bill. You're wondering what their intentions are, their true intentions. You do feel to a degree energetically that you're being sideswiped here. Somebody's not revealing their true intentions yet. You, There is a lot of trust issues involved with this. Okay. I'm kind of getting that. There's the letting down of somebody here gently. But somebody does want to re resurrect a connection here with you. It's put you at a crossroads. It does mean a change of lifestyle. Somebody who is telling you they've changed. You don't trust that energy. Mm. There has been the desire for change in you. you. You're wishing the situation changed. You're perhaps wishing somebody else would change. Okay, they, the, they're coming in with the best intentions, but it's, it's their motives that you're kind of questioning on getting. I'm getting that this news coming in does involve you reprioritizing. Your attention is certainly being shifted. You could be dealing with an Aquarius Libra Gemini here and getting a lot of air energy here. They've certainly been watching you. You've been watching them. Facebook, Twitter, WhatsApp, FaceTime, exactly. But there's been no action and then all of a sudden communication coming in. It's a very challenging situation. I'm getting that a lot of you have been keeping somebody from the past at arm's length, but they are very, very determined to reconcile.
in a way, it was pleasurable to be around this person, but you saw it as a very superficial, in and out, unbalanced situation. You want something more grounded. Possibly at the time you felt this person didn't pay you the attention that they, you felt you deserved. Okay, I am getting there was a part in other ways. I'm picking up two very, very different lifestyles here. You've been doing a lot of contemplating. They've been doing a lot of reevaluating. There's been some missed opportunities in the past. And there's a lot of regrets here. Mm. There is a lot of the moon energy around this. Fear. You do feel somebody's holding out on you. Okay, they're not telling you everything. For some of you, there's no communication at all, but they are watching you. There's a, there's a fear of being discovered here. Perhaps they're in a situation where they're married or whatever, or, you know, they're obliged to keep their keep their private life clandestine, but for whatever reason you feel somebody's holding out on you. Mm, there is this fear of commitment. The history with this person will give you a lot of the answers you need. And that should help you make your decision on whether to go forward with this person or not. Let's see what else we have. Third party involvement. I could say they could could well be this person is seeing somebody else, they could have a child, they could be married, you could be in the same situation. There's a very, very strong influence here. There is legal issues involved in this with the regards to perhaps a a sale of a property or a divorce of some kind. If you're waiting on good news from the legal side regarding your situation as far as a house or a child on getting a decision going your way, but there will have to be compromises made. I'm getting during this process, there's a better understanding of the people around you. Hmm. I'm getting there's a lot of stress going on at the moment as well. For some of you, this is unwanted attention. I'm picking up recovery here, but from your point of view, it's going to take a long time. I'm not getting that there's recovery here in five minutes. It's going to be a long time before you trust this communication. There is, for some of you, a situation where you're just plain bored. You desire this change. Yeah, it's, there you are, confidence. Your intuition has been telling you about the return of somebody from your past. Hmm. But what I'm getting most of all around you, whether you're dealing with somebody from the past, your present situation, or dealing with somebody new, your confidence sure is growing. I am getting relocation for some of you, either temporarily or permanently, a getaway so that you can get your head wrapped around this. All right, but basically, you want your freedom. There's been a lot of codependency around you in the past. You know, some very clingy energy. And you know, you're an ex by nature, you're an explorer, you're an individual, very strong, very passionate. You could even seek the advice of a friend. Okay. I'm even getting one scenario here for you where there's been a friendship for a long time and it's developing into something more. Mm. But either way, you're, you're decluttering energy. And whether that involves letting go of people, friends, past relationships, 
this is what you're doing there's a very strong individual coming out in you 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 you're becoming much more like you some of you are dealing with a player type energy okay but what i'm getting is here you making a a, a decision rather impulsive in action but it's it's decision that you've been contemplating and then all of a sudden un, unexpected news comes in and there's a rather a, impulsive reaction and within this impulsive reaction uh, does mean travel you just want to keep things on a friendly basis you're out you you're not thinking long term you're, you're thinking very very short term to see how it goes but that's that doesn't cut out the possibilities of you know committing in the future but right now and certainly in the very near future you you just want to have fun you know very very strong connection around this you could well be doing dealing with a soulmate i could say whatever your situation this is somebody from your past coming in there's a lot of deliberation a lot of re-evaluation it's certainly got you thinking about your present situation it does appear very exciting okay part of the part of the challenge here is resisting the temptation to just jump in mm. but i'm getting you getting very creative and i'm talking to one person here who is dealing with not only two people but a work opportunity as well so it's a lot of reprioritizing going on and it's the confidence to act on what you want to do and that's certainly coming just get one more card here reconciliation dealing with the past coming to terms with childhood's problems making a decision and off you go much more joyous enter much more joyous energy around you that's where you're heading but at the moment things are you know a bit erratic you're not quite sure but going forward i'm kind of getting you you know dropping a lot of the responsibilities that's being put on you somebody is trying to lay the guilt trip on you it's not working the six of cups this you know letting this person back into your life for now perhaps on friendly terms to see how it goes but you're in control thanks very much for watching